Hi everybody, I'm back again. I've just reviewed Big Bananas Altogether IPA at 5.8%. I've drink, drunk it, it's uh, gone down very well. Uh, so I thought, I might as well, uh, as I'm on a roll, I might as well do another one. This was sent to me, oh, not so long ago, a few days really, uh, from uh, Red Dog Brewer, John. Uh, he sent me three beers and this one is called Double IPA at 7.2%. Now that's a bit stronger than the one I've just made, the Niper. That was about 7%. So I'm going to review this and have no information. There was a slight hiss there. Ah, yes, I can see the um, bubbles going up. It's not gushed. Oh, <laughs> similar smells to uh, Big Bananas, I think. But this one's a, a lot stronger, 7.2. As I say, I have no information. I don't think he did a video. So let's have a pour. Um, it's certainly not a New England IPA by the look of it. It's like a, a bitter colour. Um, I made one like this a few years ago. Um, I can't remember. It was the Schultz Brewery and this it was a similar colour to this. Oh, it was a West Coast uh, IPA. So I'm wondering if this one is. I think he's taking it off his keg. Yeah, there's no sediment. Oh, lovely carbonation. Nothing in the bottle. Look at that. It's a bit similar to Big Bananas in a way. It's a bit hazy. You can nearly see through it, but not quite. Similar head to his, about a good, well, one finger. I'd say the smell wasn't quite as strong as uh, that one, but we're not comparing them one against the other. You get that citrus uh, aroma, you know, your citra, Amarillo, Simcoe, those sort of... Uh, aromas i don't know i've no idea what hops you might have put columbus in centennial i've no idea let's have a taste then my god <laughs> now that is a heavier mouthfeel than uh, the other one i had but you'd expect that 7.2 oh that that is superb my wife's waving to me to come all the way. Um, I'm more bothered about drinking this beautiful beer. That is definitely not a session beer. That's a connoisseur's beer, is that? It's got a really smooth mouthfeel, but it's heavy. And it, it's full of dark flavour. There's some dark flavours there, some slightly roast, just a little bit of roast and toffee-like flavours on the malt. But it's mingled with the fruitiness of the hops. As I said, not as, quite as fru fruity as the uh, last one I did. But I'd love to know what hops are in that. Centennial, Simcoe, I don't know. That is another superb beer. Thank you to Red Dog Brewer. I would score that exactly the same as Big Bananas, around 9 out of 10. I'd be proud if I'd made that. Thanks very much, John. Excellent. Cheers.